Hey guys, it's Coach Conway coming at you. I want to talk to you a little bit today about cooking, right? So you guys that have been around me a long time, you know that I love to cook. I've got a particular barbecue grill and smoker. And I go out there on Saturday or Sunday and I cook meals for like a whole week. A friend of mine and myself were talking not long ago about trying out some new dishes. And he was talking about, you know, he's about to serve it, he said, they're really not sure if this is going to be any good or not. And it kind of struck me off guard because I don't really serve anything unless I've tried it myself, right? I mean, when you're in the middle of cooking something, um, you don't want your guests to get all like, <laughs> this is not any good. So I made sure I sampled what I've tried before I've served it to my guests out there. My question for you guys that are in the mortgage business out there, <laughs> have you sampled what your product is? What I mean by that is, if you've got like an online application, have you gone and filled it out yourself to see what the process is like so you know a little bit what to tell the clients to expect? The other example is, have you tried out your competitor's product? So if you owned a restaurant, what I want to know is, if I had a steakhouse, I want to know what all the good steakhouses were in town, what they did differently, what I might be able to do to copy. So have you gone out and looked at what the other competitors that you have or how they're marketing, how they're placing themselves and branding themselves? So this is the, the lesson for the day, guys. It comes from the Chef Conway. I'm, I may be looking at doing a, a new Cooking with Coach Conway segment. So how are you tasting your product before you put it out there for, for sampling? Okay? Coach Conway coming at you. Hey, remember, never settle for par.